How's it going heroes and I am back with another video so now we are going to be talking about Doctor Strange yes so when I came into the theater what I was expecting was a crazy all-out right-in-your-face movie um, I was expecting a lot of cameos you know expected to see a lot of different universes well Sort of got that. Okay. This is a spoiler, so don't watch if you haven't seen it yet, um, obviously. Doctor Strange, <coughs> excuse me, was a really, really fantastic movie. Great storytelling, great visuals. I loved the character setups. I loved how they utilized the characters. Overall, a really, really good movie. Sam Raimi. Oh my lord. Sam Raimi is one of my favorite directors. And he outright knocked this movie out of the park. Like his, his, his style of filming, you know, it's noticeable. You know, the, the camera shots that go like right in your face. You know, like, a, like the Evil Dead. If you've seen the Evil Dead, you know. So... Unbelievable stuff that he was able to create this in a superhero genre movie. You know, in a movie where it's all superheroes, nice and dandy. He made this as dark as he could. And he delivered. Um, I will say this. Um... I was a bit disappointed on the lack of cameos. Now, they were building this up as to where we were going to see, like, 15 different cameos of, like, different... I mean, I got the list right here. We made that list. I I wrote Ghost Rider, Sleepwalker, Living Tribunal. We did see them for just, like, three seconds. Nightmare, Wolverine, Deadpool, Namor. Um, Ghost Rider, you know, it's like we, we had this expectation that we were going to see a lot of big names like you know and we just didn't um i will say though the illuminati man that was ah oh, bittersweet bittersweet guys and um you know i my first three here were captain carter reed richards and black bull this was before they showed captain carter and uh you know we got a live action like, comic accurate Black Bolt. Unbelievable. Like, I freaked out when I saw the costume, man. That costume was beautiful. Reed Richards. We finally got John Krasinski as Reed Richards. But, all good things must not last. They get killed like that. Um, you know, Wanda blows Black Bolt's brain into smithereens. Um, that was a bit of underwhelming. I kind of thought that, I mean, they're the Illuminati, you know, and they get wiped out in a split second like that. I know, obviously, they're a different, you know, universe, whatever, multiverse, but still, you're the Illuminati, you know, so I got three of those, four of those right here. I was bummed we didn't get to see Namor. Um, that would have been really nice to see, but I think we might be getting him in Black Panther. You know, I don't know. But I think we might be so. I just... The story was really good. But I felt... And you know what's weird is like this movie I think was only like 2 hours and like 10 or 15 minutes. It felt a lot longer. Maybe because I hadn't slept in like 20 hours. But... It felt a lot longer than what it, I thought it was. So... You know... I can't complain. And I mean... Professor X... Um... He did a really good job in that movie. I loved it, you know. I don't mind not seeing him again, but he did a, like, a fair, a farewell, I guess you can say, you know, to uh, that character. It would have been nice to see James McAvoy, but, you know, what can you do? Overall, man, I, I, I enjoyed this. This is definitely a top three Marvel movie. I love the horror aspect. I am a big horror fan. And I just, to, to have that into a Marvel movie, it just, it was fantastic. And Bruce Campbell, 
hilarious. And then um, that end, the end credit scene or mid credit scene, uh, where Clea comes in and they have to go. I'm not too sure what. Oh, they're talking about the the convergence. I think convergence. So I think that will be leading up to Secret Wars, which oh boy. If we can get God Emperor Doom or something like that, oh, that would be fantastic. But, and is there anything else that I'm missing? I don't know. I mean, uh, Wong. Uh, Wong was a really good character in this in this movie too. I liked the way you know they portrayed Wong. Um, America Chavez. Eh, she is all right. She wasn't. She wasn't used as much as I thought they would, but she's a pretty useless character in the movie, you know? Outside of just going from multiverse to multiverse. You know, they had the end where she was like punching Wanda, but overall, pretty useless character, I think. So, I don't know. But, yeah. So, what did you guys think? I'm just so happy that I finally got to see a comic accurate Black Bolt. Like, even though they killed him off, I hope we get him again. Um, Anson Mount, fantastic. And John Krasinski, of course. Krasinski. So, that's going to be it for the video, guys. I, I really appreciate it. Uh, thanks a lot, and I'll see you guys in my next video.